this is a PowerShell tutorial 7. We are not going to go any deeper into the help system yet, but there are a few things I want to show you to make your use of the help system a little more efficient. Just some quick tips for the beginner and you'll learn a few commands and some other tips at the same time. I want to get some help on something called get command. We're not going to go into what get command is at this time. It's just so I can show you some quick tips here. So get help get command enter. I didn't see the top of the page, but what I wanted was at the bottom and I want the full help here still to prove a point. And we're going to use clear. We don't need to use it, but it's just probably easier for uh, everybody else to follow along. So we want get help get command full. This is what you're going to get a lot of the time in PowerShell. Things just scrolling by you. In normal PowerShell use, you can avoid this by piping it to more. And the pipe command on my keyboard is at the left of the numbers. It might be placed somewhere else on your keyboard. But here's how it works. First, let's clear this off. Get help. Get command and then we pipe this to more. That's your pipe sign, more. This is what we want. You are at the top of the help file. You learn something new, which you will use a lot, piping to more, but not when it comes to using help. You are going to use help so much that you want to be more efficient. So, What we do here is uh, we take away the pipe to more, which you will be using a lot, and we take away the get, including the dash, and enter, and we get the same thing. If you just use help, it will show the same as piping to more. It's the same thing, help and get help. The only difference here is that help is a function and get help is a commandlet. That was your first quick tip. Use the pipe to more on other things, just not the help. Okay, you are at the top of your help file. Now, what you usually want here is one page at the time and you do that by using the spacebar and it will give you one page at the time. If you want one line at the time you use the return key. One line at the time. I uh, think you need to use the scroll bar to move uh, back. I can't recollect uh, if there is a uh, key combination for that. Using uh, the spacebar and one page at a time will eventually get you to the bottom of the help file and to the command line again. But if you already found what you're looking for at uh, page 2, all you do is control C and you're out of uh, the help file and back to the command line. If uh, you have a uh, Linux background, you could always use man get command full and it will uh, get you the same thing as help and get help. Man is uh, a nickname for help or uh, an alias as it's called in uh, PowerShell. There are more things you can play around with to make life easier using the help file, but this covers your uh, basic needs for now. And here's a few things that can be interesting to know, but has nothing to do with the quick tips themselves. Let's use uh, the command get command. Get command more. Here you see help and that's a function 
and uh, get help is a commandlet. We didn't have any um, aliases here, so um, let's do uh, get command all more and we have uh, alias man is help and we can do this uh, one more way get command help it's a function get command get help is a um, commandlet and uh, get command man is an alias that's it for now uh, I know it's been a little confusing and uh, I might not have uh, done this tutorial the best way but that's it for now